Cardi B. Who, per usual, I guess she bored being at home and pregnant. Because she decided to take the time to clap back at somebody. I, I wouldn't even call him a fan. Let's call him a hater. Because they wound up saying or accusing her of bleaching her skin. Which, no shade, but I guess it'll be a valid situation when it comes, if we talk about Dominican people in general, a lot of y'all do be out here bleaching y'all skin. It ain't just them. It's a lot of Caribbeans. They do the same damn thing. And Sammy Sosa, didn't he recently bleach his skin and everybody was going in and letting have on him? Over his, uh, all of a sudden, his new, color, his new complexion. So the hit maker who which I ain't even going to try to say her name. We'll just go with Cardi. So the hit maker harshly barked back at the fan as she said she would never do something so dangerous while pregnant. Well, didn't she say that she... Damn, what was it that she said that she did? Oh, that she, would, she took some type of medication or type of drug while she was pregnant with her child because she was going through so much pain and people was reading her online for... for putting her body at risk. I was like, look, if the doctor said it's okay. But then again, we can't really trust doctors because look, what happened with Matthew Perry? So she said this, no, she said the singer also told the fans she was dumb and thinking with her asshole. <laughs> the 31-year-old Bodak Yellow Hitmaker is expecting her third child with a strange husband offset. Now, skin bleaching is a common cosmetic practice worldwide. However, many use skin bleaching products to lighten their complexion, according to medical news today. It said that is dangerous and there's no safe or reliable way to lighten someone's skin tone with bleach. First of all, I would never risk that. I was like, I like when I get my tans or whatever. And that's what it is. It's like, if I get a tan, I get a tan. Like, y'all can see with my arms or whatever. I do have a tan. And I was looking a little dark at one point. And my skin is leveling out. And then, first of all, there's, like, this soap that a friend of mine turned me on. Where it's like, if you got any, like, blotches, whatever the case is, that it helps even out your skin. But I would never want to do something that dangerous and lighten my skin. I like my complexion. So anyway, they said bleach while pregnant. Why y'all? Why must y'all be so dumb? Actually, no, I'm pregnant. I'm slightly anemic. This baby's sucking all the energy off my body to the point I'm pale. Yet I sunk in veins green ASF. Can't tan under the sun because I get hot super fast and dizzy. Please stop thinking with your ass. <laughs> why she always gotta address these people? But I guess you know what? In this in this situation, I feel like when you start to put out narratives that's this dangerous or whatever the case is, and got people thinking a certain type of way. The best thing you need to do is defend it. Now, there'd be other times where I'd be like, Cardi, leave it alone. You ain't got to be addressing these crazy-ass people on social media. But I do with some, feel like with something like this, especially with people questioning you on your on some of the things you be doing while pregnant, then it's, I would bring it up. She actually um, also brought up the, the person who did it. So this is a picture of her appearing light. But I don't even know. So I've never, you know, I'm a man, born cis male. I can't get pregnant. So I don't know anything about that. But women, jump in the comments if you can and let me know, is it a thing that when you are pregnant and you are darker skin, is it possible that when you're a woman of color and you have a child, that the baby does do all these things that she was saying in regards to her physical appearance? that the baby's sucking all the energy off of her body to the point that she's pale. Your eyes get sunken, your veins get green as, as fuck, can't tan in the sun because you get hot super fast and dizzy. So I don't know. So I'm wondering, is, is that an actual thing? That Can that possibly happen? If that can happen, let me know in the chat or in the comments if you watch this after the show is done. She also said that she feared that she suffered a miscarriage after having a freak accident. This was early in the month. The 31-year-old rapper has revealed via social media that she recently suffered a health scare that left her fearing for her life of her unborn child. Cardi, who already has Wave, who's two, and Culture, who's six, with the estranged husband offset, said on X, well, sorry, Twitter, she said, I had an effing freak accident. I don't know how something, well, it wasn't little, it actually hurt. It doesn't really happen often, but it became something that is so big to the point I was literally paralyzed. But yeah, and that little thing almost caused my little one to come, but it didn't. Yesterday I was feeling good. I came home 
and I came home, but I came home as a Kai, as a Kai. And I think that's what it was when um, people were like, oh, now you're putting your child at risk because that was a comment when she went and said that, that she had a scare or whatever. And I guess maybe she went to the doctor and they gave her something that may have had her high, but hopefully it didn't affect the unborn child. So she said, today I woke up sober, honey. I'm dying like I'm dying. I swear to God, if I don't get feel good in four hours, I'm going to the hospital again. Oh, that's what it is. Because she, um, she wanted them to give her morphine. And people would sit up in here talking about, um, should you be getting morphine injected into you while pregnant? So people was complaining about that. Talking about, oh, you taking morphine while you're pregnant. But she's talking about how much she's in pain. This is why I feel like after this baby says, you need to tie them tubes. Because if you're going around feeling a ways about your stomach being and being in a lot of pain and how your third child is putting so much wear and tear on you physically, then I think that's something you need to worry about and take into consideration. So, yeah. Um, after all this being said and done, I just hope after that, girl... Tie them tubes and get this damn second album out because you've been spending more time giving birth to kids than giving birth to records. So I will say all this to say, what do y'all think of this story? Do y'all think that Miss Cardi out here bleaching her skin? Like I said before, if it is a possible thing that, you know, when you have a kid that it does all kinds of things to your body, including draining the complexion out of your situation. <laughs> like, I ain't never heard of that. But like I said, I don't necessarily know because I can't, I'm not, a, I can't get pregnant. So I don't know what that experience is like. But for those of you who do, and this, if this is happening to you or not, let me know what you guys think of this story in the comments down below.